Welcome to part three of our HVACdirect.com Getting Started series. In this video, we'll walk you through the process of purchasing a replacement for your existing HVAC equipment. Here are a few clear signs it's time to replace your old unit. When your home is no longer comfortable in the summer or winter, the AC runs too often or the house warms up between cycles or the opposite during the heating season, your energy bills keep going up year after year, and there are unusual noises and or vibrations. Repairs and service calls are too frequent, or is it more than 15 years old? Air conditioners and furnaces do wear out over time and replacing your old equipment can save you from wasting money on another repair or on high energy bills. The first step is to determine what you have now. The easiest way to do this is to look at the owner's manual or the model tags on your units to get the model number and you've already started building your shopping list. Not every installation will have an outside unit or inside unit, but any model number you can find will help determine what you have, making it easier to find a matching unit. If you can't find any of that information, consult with an HVAC installer to help you with an equipment list. Second, ask yourself, when it was working, were you happy with the way your home heated and cooled? If yes, use the current system as a base model. Take note of system size, type, and airflow direction of the furnace unit. As an example, if you have a 100,000 BTU 92% efficient natural gas upflow furnace and a three ton air conditioning system, and it was doing a good job when it was working well, then those are the specs you will be adding to your shopping list. This is also a good time to take your old unit's efficiency into consideration, especially if it was older than 15 years. The good news is that most modern furnaces and air conditioners will be more efficient than your old ones, but it is important to understand the relationship between geography and efficiency. For example, if you live in a warm climate and your electric bills are steadily on the rise, it's best that you consider a high efficiency air conditioner. On the other hand, if you live in the northern part of the country, you don't need a highly efficient air conditioner, but rather a more efficient furnace instead. In our example system, you will still look for the same size specs, but you might opt for a two-stage 97% efficient furnace with a variable speed blower and a 16 sear air conditioner to gain advantage of a more efficient system. The new system will perform better than the old one and be more efficient and less expensive to operate. Now that you have your list, you're set. Be sure to view our other videos in the HVACdirect.com Getting Started series to better understand our sizing guide, efficiency ratings, and how to shop our website. If you need any further assistance or have additional questions, please give us a call, send us an email, or chat with us online.